On September 7th, an undercover reporter walked into the Houston, Texas headquarters of Organizing for America, the community organizing arm of the campaign to re-elect President Obama. She told the regional field director she spoke with she was registered in both Texas and Florida and wanted to vote twice in order to help re-elect the president. According to FEC disclosure documents obtained by Project Veritas, the director we caught on tape is in fact a salaried employee of the DNC. So I spent some time in Florida and I got my voter registration card for Florida. So, and I know that we have, you know, it's a, a battleground state there. So keep it, keep it. <laughs> so you're gonna vote, uh, yeah, vote by ballot. I'm gonna yeah. vote by ballot, oh, and yeah. then I have mine here too. It really concerns me that if we don't do everything we can, we're not gonna win. So you're gonna, this election. Okay, so you have to make sure because after 60 days, mm -hmm. you can send in your application to vote by mail ballot. Okay. So I can print it out for you. Okay. On Wednesday, I'll print it out. Mm -hmm. You just have to mail it back in. Or okay. Back. Or fax it back in so that I could do. So they'll send you a bail of mail ballot. And mail so, and there's no way that they would be able to cross reference that they can I. Can you it twice? Yeah. Um, I don't know. That's, that's not my expertise. Okay. I would just do Florida because in Texas it really doesn't. That's probably true. And let me know about that. I mean, I don't, I don't want to do anything wrong, but if no one's gonna know, like. I'll definitely look into it. it. Yeah. I don't want you to get in trouble at all. Yeah, I don't want to get in trouble, but like I said, if no one's going to know, I don't know if I'll look at it. Yeah. <laughs> so, anyway. But. Oh my god, this is so funny. It's cool though. <laughs> a few weeks later, our undercover reporter met with the same director again, who gave her a Florida absentee ballot application to help her vote twice, while telling her that if anyone checks, to say, quote, I don't know. But I was going to see, as far as all the registering for Florida, mm -hmm. where do I get the forms to do that? Or not register voting in Florida for the absentee? Oh. So what you'll have to do is you're going to call into Florida. Okay. And call... Are you going to do what I think you're going to do? Well, I mean, if no one's going to know. <laughs> because I have several friends who, who've done that and they said that it's no problems, plus. Yes, but come up with like your end of the day, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> well, just because, I mean, it's, I don't know, it's so important, everything that we're doing here is so important yeah. that there's absolutely no way, um, if I have an opportunity to make my voice heard, I'm gonna make my voice twice. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna make it heard twice, so. Okay. Excellent. Okay. And so then all I do... I'm not quite sure, actually. I'm oh, there's instructions up yeah. here. By mail. Okay. I'll figure it out. Excellent. No problem. No problem. <laughs> I know we can totally do we this. Can do it. <laughs> All right. If you have any problems with the okay. okay. I definitely will. All right. You too. Bye bye. That wasn't the only exchange we recorded. We visited Organizing for America voter registration tables around New York and Organizing for America headquarters around the country. No, I'm from Minnesota, so I'm gonna I'm gonna vote there. Oh, you're gonna vote in Minnesota? Okay, you have to register there then. I'm probably gonna vote in both. No matter okay, what, well, make the list in. Okay, I'm gonna vote in both places probably. So Mitt Romney does not take New York <laughs> or Minnesota, right? Three buttons, three votes. Could I take this with me? Is that okay? Okay. Uh, the form with you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And you don't need a postage. And there's already. Oh, cool, cool. Um, you don't have to add a stamp to it either. Okay. Can I have a couple for my uh, sure. friends as well? Sure. We're all we're all going to make sure Mitt Romney doesn't win Minnesota or New York. <laughs> we have to vote often and vote. Yep, exactly. So, thank you. Uh, I'm going to vote there. You're going to vote in Minnesota. Uh, yeah, and and probably here as well. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> I'm not... Could you register now? I'll hand it in for you. Oh, really? Yeah, I, I take, collect them all. I bring them to the Secretary of State's office. Okay. And that way you don't have to be bothered with a stamp or getting it in or okay. whatever. 
When a Democrat says he wants to vote twice, he is told to take as many voter registration forms as he likes. Can I take a couple with me? You can. You can take as many as you want with okay. you. Okay. All right. When a Republican tries to legally register other Republicans to vote, he is told that the voter registration forms are, quote, valuable. Can I take a couple of these with me? To... I, okay. I need them. They're valuable, but I, you can take a couple. Okay. Is this where I uh, registered to vote for Romney? Obama out. Yeah, Romney in. And that's private equity. You definitely look like the guy that did the. Are you saying that he hires prostitutes and, and runs them around? You are generalizing about Republicans, aren't you?